G'day, welcome to the Tech Math Channel. I'm Josh. Today, we're going to be looking at adding decimals together. And it's not so bad, it's just a matter of setting them out the right way, and then you'll have absolutely no problems. Lots of examples coming along, so stay tuned. So first off, we're going to have a look at this one here, 3.2, and to that, we're going to add 15.6, and see what that equals. So as I said, the very first thing is setting out, and setting out is basically the major part of this. The way that we do this is as follows is we're going to start with our 3.2, and we're going to be adding to this 15.6. Now, the big thing to make sure of here is that the decimal places line up. So we're going to have that decimal place directly underneath and work our way around that. Uh, we're going to have the 15 just here and the 6 just there. And as you can see, the major part, those decimals line up. So now what we do is we just treat this like a standard addition. We have 2 plus 6 is equal to 8. The decimal place moves down. And then we have 3 plus 5 is equal to 8. And 1 plus 0 is equal to 1. We have our answer, 18.8. .8. Pretty easy, right? Like I said, it's just in the setting out, and then you'll have absolutely no problems. So what about we have a look at another example? Let's go uh, 8.01. And to this, we're going to add 13.1. All right. So, like I said, the trick is first off in the setting out. So, we're going to start with 8.01. So, we put our 8.01 there, and we're going to be adding to this. Like before, the decimals are going to line up. That's probably the most important thing there. So, we have 13, which is going to go to the left of the decimal place there, and we have 0.1. Now, just a little tip before we start adding these. You're going to notice that... On the 8.01, we have two decimal places. For 13.1, we only have one decimal place. What we can do is it's well worth adding a zero to this, and it keeps the number the same value. 13.1 is the same as 13.10. It's the same value, but it makes life easier when we're adding up to have that same amount of decimal places. So now we can go through and add this together. We have 1 plus 0 is equal to 1. 0 plus 1 is equal to 1. We have the decimal place, which moves down. We have... 8 plus 3, which is equal to 11, with a 1. And finally, we have the 1 plus 1 is equal to 2. There's our answer, 21.11. All right, I reckon you're just about ready for it. What about a couple of these that you can try now? We'll start with uh, 13.41, and then you're going to add to that 1.62. Cool. The next one we'll do after that one is we'll have a look at uh, what about we try 14.6, and to that we're going to add, uh, let's go 29.91. Awesome. So, what about you pause the video, give these a go, and then we'll come back and have a look at the answers. So, have you done that? All right, so let's have a look at these. So, we start with 13.41. 13.41, and we're going to line that decimal up underneath. So, there's going to be an addition there. We have 1.62, so we have 1 here. And the 6.2 goes right here. All right. We have the decimal places. The same amount. We don't need to modify there at all. Let's just go through and add. 1 plus 2 equals 3. We have 4 plus 6. 4 plus 6 is equal to 10. So there goes a 0 there. And the 1 gets carried across. The decimal place moves down. Like before. We have 1 plus 3 plus 1. 1 plus 3 plus 1 is equal to 5. And then finally, we have this 1. 1 plus 0. We have our answer. 15.03. How did you go on that? Okay. So what about we have a look at this second example? We have 14.6 plus 29.91. As before, the trick is in the setting out. So first off, we have 14.6. Okay. And to that, we're going to be adding 29. And we have the decimal place here, so they line up 0.91. What you're going to notice once again is we have... One decimal place here and two decimal places here. So let's just put a zero on there just so it all has that same amount of decimal places. So what do we have when we do this? Zero plus one is equal to one. Six plus nine. Six plus nine is equal to 15. So we have the five down here. We carry the one across and we put our decimal place down there. We have one plus nine is equal to 10 plus four is equal to 14. We put the four there and carry the one. Finally, we have 2 plus 1, which is equal to 3. Our answer, 34.51. And there you have it. That's how you go through and you add decimals together. It's really simple. As I said, it's all in the setting out. Absolutely no problem. 
Anyway, if you like this video, please remember, hit the like button and subscribe for more math videos. And a big shout out to my patrons and subscribers. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Your support is always well appreciated. Anyway, thank you for watching. See you next time. Bye.